utilizing your assets. I think that's something that's important when you're being independent. You need to know um, what you are actually good at. And you know what I realized? Um, when I was growing up, I used to be, I used to enjoy drawing. Like, I used to like sketching, drawing faces, drawing lines, whatever. And I didn't have no one behind me to say, hey, man, you're good at that. Let me get you a kid. Or, hey, man, that's, you know, I didn't have no encouragement. And anytime you got a child who's got a passion to do something and he has no um, encouragement, something else can actually come along and he'll set that passion or that uh, gift down and pick something else up. And that's pretty much what I did, you know, by going to prison at so young of an age, you know, looking into the street life. And now I think about my ability to <clears throat> to build things and to make things that I see. I got the ability to see something that someone else has made or created, and I can duplicate it or make it better. And it, it pays me. So if I can um, look at someone else's designs and improve them and make my own, I should be able to take some time and come up with my own personal design something i can just make from stretch that can actually help a market or um, assist a market or be able to provide for my family you know so i think about that now and it just let me know how how valuable it is to know what you're good at you know what i mean i realize that i'm good at thinking outside of the box I'm good at uh, believing I can do something. Like, I don't even go into the situation thinking, oh, it can't be done. Because one thing's for a fact. I already know it can be done because somebody else has already did it. Now, I might have to do it a little different. I might have to learn something extra. But it can be done. So, when you out here networking, man, um, I would say one of your greatest assets, and this is no BS, it's knowing your limitations, knowing what you can do, what you can't do. And then once you got all that together, man, start initiating on it. Start putting some effort behind it. Start initiating, you know what I mean, building your dreams. I mean, today, today is Sunday. I'm just relaxing, man. Um, I messed around and hit my head yesterday. Head hurting, for real. And uh, so today I'm just, just sitting back chilling, man, recouping from uh, yesterday. I messed around and hit my head. Um, and it just, you know, it just dawned on me, man, about life, about what it takes. And since I've been out here in the city of Phoenix, man, I've been trying to find my niche. I've been knocking on doors. I've had doors closed. I've had doors open. I have doors crack open enough to throw in a resume. <laughs> Or throw in a business card and it locks up again, you know. But one thing that I can say, persistence. It will take you a long way and knowing what you're good at. Hog on. Y'all enjoy y'all Sunday. Black Phoenix, I'm out.